what's really cool is a whole new project. Uh, she Tempe. Claire is one of the artists involved in this. This just got underway last fall. Yes, yes, in September. And then tell us all about it because we see your artwork right here at the corner. So eight local female artists. They've taken some of their work and made reproductions and wrapped all of the newsstands to kind of help have some public art installations throughout downtown Tempe. And you can take a walking tour and visit each different station to see different people's artwork. What was the purpose of promoting She Tempe? Well, they wanted to work with local female artists making work about females. And they were really hoping to have more local artwork visible on Mill for people to, you know, I love it. Yeah, have work to look at. And that's one thing you can certainly do here. That is really neat. Claire, thank you so much. We're admiring your work. And throughout the next two hours, folks here on Good Morning Arizona, we'll be featuring all the other great things Tempe has. But right now we're saying girl power. So Olivia, yeah. April, Right back Kylie. at you, and Tess. Scotty, once again, we're, we're left out. Oh, we always yeah. are, Javier, but you know it's what? We'll uh, hold up you, our Scotty. end of the bargain. <laughs> I'm busy admiring uh, the artist's jumpsuit, too, so I get distracted easily by those uh, kind of I things. I know. Very uh, nice. Guys, we'll... jumpsuit. <laughs> Anthropology, Olivia. <gasps> Thank there you. Go. You know where I'll model. be this afternoon. There you go. Yes, <laughs> that is in right now. I love it. Looks great. Thank you, guys. You hey, have by a the, treat by for the us. way, uh, tomorrow is National Pay It Forward Day, so I wanted to uh, had a couple comments. One, I was out in Surprise the other day shooting a Surprise Squad yes. Pay It Forward at an Albertsons. So if you were part of that and you're waiting to see yourself on TV, yes. we're going to air that next Friday okay. because of the Red for Ed movement going on, yeah. and we've been really busy with that. So next Friday and tomorrow, in in remembrance of that day, is Sip a Cup, Share a Cup at. Um, uh, Dunkin, Donuts. Dunkin Donuts. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot. Anyway, uh, they're going to give you a chance to pay it forward if you buy a specialty card. Oh, but, cool. So anyway, they send in these donuts, and we've got about da, 10 da. teachers here this <gasps> morning. This is perfect. And they're going to be on in just about 10 minutes Bam. to talk about their cause. So why don't we give these donuts Agreed. to those teachers? You want to do that? Perfect timing. <clears throat> They're right over there. They're right there. I'm Who's sure ready they could use a, a few yeah. free donuts. Yeah, yeah, a little sugar before... Right. Uh, the walk out today. Uh, let's check in with April for a look at the weather. Good morning. Hey, good morning to you. You know what? It's going to be really hot for everybody who is out there today at uh, downtown. We've got, uh, again, unseasonably warm weather all week. And today we still have another day of that and another day of that high pollution advisory as well. Here's a live look at temperatures right now across the valley. 77 in downtown Phoenix. It's 70 in Gilbert and Tempe. A little cooler as usual in those outlying areas. 71 in Glendale and 76 degrees. Current temperature in Scottsdale. Temperature tracker shows just how quickly we're going to warm things up by noon today. About 90 degrees. The normal high for this time of year is 89, but yeah, we'll be above that by lunchtime and then we'll head toward a high of 98 degrees. It does mean temp uh, temperatures will be warm tonight for all your Friday night.